The VLT MicroDrive from Danfoss is a genuine VLT frequency converter with unsurpassed reliability, user friendliness, condensed functionality, and is extremely easy to commission. It can be set up to perform perfectly, even in complex application setups. Approximately 100 parameters can be set to optimize energy efficiency and operation. For a simple test startup of your Danfoss FC51 VLT microdrive, all you have to do is configure the following commands using the quick menu. To access the quick menu, press the menu key on the keypad until the indicator display is placed above the quick menu section. Next, press the up and down arrows to select either the QM1 or QM2 menu and press OK to confirm your selection. For our demonstration, we will use QM1 as it contains all of the parameters necessary for a test run. Start with parameter 1-20 to enter the motor power from your nameplate data. There are a variety of options here, so make sure you pick the one that's best for your components. Next, navigate to parameter 1-22 to enter your motor voltage from your nameplate data. After that, set your motor frequency at parameter 1-23 according to your nameplate data. Parameter 1-24 is where you will set your motor current based on your nameplate data. And finally, set your motor nominal speed using parameter 1-25 according to your nameplate data. Once you have configured these parameters, it's now time to give your drive a test run. Depending on how you have it configured, start the drive using either the hand or auto key. If your test run succeeded, you may wish to enable the automatic motor tuning option to optimize your motor performance. To do so, navigate to parameter 1-29 while the motor is not in motion and press the OK key to open the menu. The default option 0 sets AMT to off, option 2 enables AMT, and option 3 enables complete AMT with a rotating motor. It is usually recommended to run AMT because it measures the electrical characteristics of your motor to optimize compatibility between the frequency converter and the motor under WC Plus mode. For best results, run this procedure on a cold motor. You should also note that in the second AMT mode, the rotor will rotate while the test is in progress. You should not place the motor under any additional load while the test is being performed. That's it. If the test runs succeeded, then you're now free to configure additional parameters as necessary. If something went wrong, then we recommend retracing your steps to make sure that your data was entered correctly. If you'd like to configure additional drives, the keypad on this drive is removable and hot pluggable, meaning that if you want to configure more than one of these drives at a time, all you have to do is plug the keypad into the next drive and you can seamlessly copy your entire configuration over, eliminating the need for duplicate programming. For more on the VLT MicroDrive from Dan Foss and many other AC drives, please visit galco.com.